If we do not learn from the mistakes of the past, we are condemned to repeat them. I never thought in a million years that in Massachusetts um, and in Ted Kennedy's seat that that would be, as I mentioned, as a wake-up call for, for all Democrats, that we need to work or else we're not going to succeed. The American people maybe don't have a lot of patience for, uh, they want change now. People uh, were promised change and we're not seeing the uh, drastic change that I think a lot of us voted for. People are looking for something to help alleviate this economic difficulty and that something hasn't yet been given to them. I think we're all waiting for the, the, the turning point where things are going to get better but people are still unemployed, uh, people still don't have health care. People are waiting for, for someone to come in and fix this problem. Middle class America is shrinking every day um, and uh, I believe middle class America runs this country and uh, for the job losses that the middle class is losing, um, I believe that's just having a, a bad impact. I think Congress has a number of important, um, important pieces of legislation on its plate from this health care bill to climate change to a jobs bill that I understand is moving. Um, if some of that, if that legislation passes, the American public sees some of the good work that the Democrats are doing on the public's behalf, then we'll see, uh, you know, a, a real response at the ballot box. And I think that the future will look very bright. It's time to step up and do what's right, you know, what's, what's right for working people. Massachusetts really is going to serve as a wake-up call to the entire Democratic Party and to Democratic voters um, that they need to be active or else uh, they, they risk losing that majority that we've worked so hard to obtain.